Hey there, Scorpio. Welcome to the second half of December 2023. Reading for you. Let's see what's going on. Ooh, we're starting out with the Six of Presents. Someone wants to balance something out. Or maybe something coming in to balance out here. Let's see. We have here the Hermit. Ooh, are you dealing with a Virgo? Or maybe you're just going within. Trying to figure out how you can make things more balanced in the situation. Let's see what's really right here. We have here the Two of Potions. Ooh. Yeah, it feels like you're trying to make something work here, huh? There's a connection here. Maybe a soulmate connection with the two of potions. In the past, we had here the nine of potions. There was a hope to wishes, dreams come true in the past. What happened to that? Okay, so let's see what's crowning the situation. We have the ten of presents. Ooh. Someone might be coming towards you with, for a commitment maybe even. Or maybe you're working on that. This could also be money coming in for you. Let's see. Actually, I don't know if I'm going to go over more yeah so I have some room I'm doing a lot of cards over here and I don't know why I'm like crowding myself here okay and then we have here the two of presents trying to balance things out trying to figure things out maybe you're juggling something or maybe you're juggling someone hmm let's see about your energy what's going on with you oh so you're healing you might be healing a situation you might be healing from the three of swords here at the four needles that could be in the process of healing take or you could be going on vacation or or holiday i mean it's a holiday time let's see when people see you here it is the king of potions look at you with the bottle there <laughs> ready to pop the cork okay so scorpio cancer pisces energy maybe someone sees you full of a lot of love here let's see we have here, ooh, the soul machine. So mending something, fixing something with the soul machine here. I'm going to do the words in a minute. Let me just put this one down. Ooh, the ace of needles. Ooh. So what's going on here? Maybe um, your hopes or your fears, you might be, um, hope it, maybe you're cutting something out or finding the truth. Or there might be an opportunity to come towards you. Let me get the, the word on this um, king of potions here. And we have here player. Ooh. What's this? Player. Freedom. Change. Thoughts. Ooh. So maybe you were a player and now you're changing? Maybe you're changing your thoughts about being free? You might want a commitment. Is that what's going on, Scorpio? Okay. Let's see what the possible outcome is. We have here the Nine of Needles. Okay. Nine of Needles could be someone having a little anxiety, a little stress, worrying here, not sleeping at night. Let's see. And we have here the Emperor. Someone in charge, or maybe someone taking control, Aries energy. Someone wanting control. Maybe someone stressing over not having control. And we have here the Nine of Presence. This is a very independent energy. So... Hmm. It might be that you may almost feels like maybe you're coming into a new business or a new opportunity here. You might be a little stressed over it because this is something new that you're trying starting to do. We do have that what you don't see is eight of candles. Now this is fast energy. This could be communication. This could be things taken off. If you're in sales, you could be having a lot of sales. It might be just a lot that you have coming in that you don't see it yet. Okay. So now why do we have the six of presents here? Six of presents. We have the full, a new beginning. Taking a leap of faith. Trying to balance things out here. And this is the hermit, Virgo energy. Going within, healing. You got a healing card here and healing there. The hermit could be a healer. Student, a teacher. But seeking answers within. Here we have the king of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or... There could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, King of Pentacles coming towards you. Wanting to maybe heal a situation. Wanting to fix something with you. Oh, right, wrong ones. Okay, we have here the bottle opener and a leaf. 
Maybe someone's turning over a new leaf. And maybe someone drinks beer out of the bottle. Or something popped the cap here. Something that you, a soda pop or a beer bottle. Turn on a new leaf. If that means anything to you, you'll know. Let's see. Let's get the word on this King of Pentacles. Cheater. Jealousy. Ooh, a tower. Okay, someone might be surprising you or something might be happening. If this person was a cheater and they're jealous, maybe there's something coming out. Maybe someone's getting surprised here. Okay, Aries Scorpio energy with the tower. What about the two of potions? The six of wands. You're going to have a victory here and some kind of connection. This could be a soulmate connection. could be a love connection. could be a business connection, friendship. But it looks like you're going to have some kind of victory here in a partnership. Now, the nine of cups in the um, past. What's that all about? There was a ending here a major transformation a change maybe someone's trying to come back now that's scorpio energy so there might be a major major change from something from the past trying to return here now we do have this is ten of pentacles is it not uh yeah ten of pentacles yeah someone might be trying to come back for a commitment we have here okay we have the three of swords but look at this this is like a definitely third party look at the First woman's walking with that gentleman and she's handing someone else a note. So maybe that was some kind of cheater, some kind of jealousy. And now you're wondering, I don't know if I trust this person coming back in now. They hurt me. Okay, what about this um, two of pentacles? We have here king of cups. Wow. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces energy. Could be your energy. Yeah, I think you have a choice here. See what you want to do. You might have a couple of different people though. Okay, let's get the charm on this King of Cups. We have here. Oh, we have the this person might bring you flowers. Look at this. So you have the shares for cutting flowers. So they might work in the florist, or you work in the florist, or maybe someone has a, a fondness for flowers, or they have a garden. Okay, let's see. Put the word on this. King of Cups. Oh yeah, they come in with love. Lover. Ooh, surprise. Okay. We do have a surprise here. You might have two people showing up at <laughs> once. Oh my gosh. Airy Scorpio Energy. Both this is the cheater and this is the lover. <laughs> Maybe you're the one who had two people. I was you know, why do I always assume it's the other person? Maybe it's you. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. The four of swords. Four of needles. The strength. You have you have the strength to heal whatever you need to heal here with the four of needles. And the way people see you as the king of potions. Yeah, so we have the king of potions here twice. Hmm. So we have a five of pentacles. Yeah, you're looking at something. You're not sure about something. Is it worth your while? Now, this could be you here, or this could be another King of Pentacles. I'm King of Pentacles, sorry. King of Cups coming towards you. I mean, this is the King of Pentacles. Yeah, you might have two people. But you might be also someone that has a lot of love to give. You both, you know, you have, you're a king. You have kings coming in here. What about this Ace of Needles? We have the Four of Pentacles. Someone might be putting a stop to someone being a glutton. Look at this this woman. She's just stuffing her face here. So yeah, overindulging. Hmm. Being a piggy. What about the nine of needles? We have the eight of cups. Yeah, it looks like you're moving away from the stress. You're like, I had enough of that. Now we have the emperor energy. What's up with this emperor? We have the queen of pentacles. Okay. So, Queen of Pentacles is focused on the family, with the home, or maybe even the money here. Tending to the money, because Queen of Pentacles is financially okay here. We have a king to go to the queen, if you're the queen. Trying to take, maybe you're just trying to take care of 
things that in your home here, taking control of a situation. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have here. Oh yeah, the wheel. Taking the wheel. Taking control. Okay, let me get the words on the Queen of Pentacles. We have here later intruder returns. Ooh. <laughs> Okay, say there's two kings of cups together here, and this person was jealous and intruded. Well, maybe they're coming back. I almost feel like it's that energy. I would say that you're you're this king, or yeah, you're this king. This is another person, and then you also could be the queen of pentacles with the emperor there, trying to take control of your life, trying to um, deal with your finances, your home. And then we have this cheater that's jealous comes back in. And messes things up a little bit. Okay, what about this? This is the nine of presents, right? Nine of presents. Okay, independent energy. What's going on with that? We have here the eight of swords. Okay, someone is look. I love that cat. Is he so cute? He's so grumpy. It's like getting all wet here. But you know what? The whole thing is he's getting upset. He's sitting in his tub here. He just has to get up. That's what the eight of swords is all about. It's like someone is stressing over something that they can move out of. Now we have here the Seven of Swords. Mm. Okay, so we have here the Seven of Candles. Ah, look at this. See, there's some kind of cheating or some kind of... I, you know what I'm going to say? There's some hanky-panky going on. That's what I think. Look at that card. Now we have that. And then we have this card. So, you might be fighting for something here. Maybe either fighting back for someone trying to um, maybe fool around or do something here. Or, yeah, take it how it might resonate with you. You know what it is. Because if you have someone that cheated on you or there's third party, you'll know exactly where they go. And what that's all about. But it feels like here at Seven of Wands, someone's going to fight for whatever they believe in here. Okay. So now let's see what signs you could be dealing with. What are the signs here for Scorpio? Let's see. Now this could be placement, your chart, placement, other people chart, past, present, and future. We have here Pisces. Sagittarius. Cancer. Aquarius. Libra. And Capricorn. Okay, again, placement, your chart, placement, other people chart, past, present, and future. We have Pisces, Sagittarius, Cancer, Aquarius, Libra, and Capricorn. Now we'll do the letters. We're going to do 11 letters for initials. First name, last name. If you get both someone's initials for the first and last name, and they have a middle name, and you know that middle name, and you get that initial also, all the better. Past, present, and future, also your own initials. We have D, L, G, D, E, oops, J, F, S, K, W, E. Okay, the letters we have for you today are D, L, G, D, E, J, F, S, K, W, E. Now we'll do the names. 11 or more names. Let me come up. Okay, so we have here Nate Capri Grady Melly M E L I T T E A. We have Corey C O R E Y. We have Mikhail M E C H I E L. Paulie P A U L E. Dini, D-I-N-I, -I. Sam, Flo, Jean, G-E-N-E, -E. Larry, Bouchon, B-H-O-O-S-H-A-N, and 
Stavian, S T I V E N. So we have 3, 6, 9, 14, no, 15. Okay, 15 names. All right, guys, now remember, these are general readings, they're not personal readings. Please take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Please let me know if it resonates. Please leave comments. I love to read your comments. If it does not resonate, check out your other placements, your sun, your moon, your rising, your Venus sign. Something might resonate with you more, and your other placement might give you that missing piece, that missing link. The part of the puzzle makes everything click together for you guys. I want to thank you guys so much for all your love and support. I truly appreciate you guys. I love you so much. Thank you for your likes, your shares, your subscribes, your comments, your super thanks. I appreciate it all. And I hope to see you all again real soon. Thank you.